Well, I was here in the Harley shop here at Mid-America Harley, and um, the guys at the counter suggested them to me. They know I have a bad back. They offered to put them on for me, give me a test ride. I was uh, really skeptical about the price at first because they're really expensive. But on the other hand, you know, I want to be able to ride, and I was getting to the point where it was getting real painful. Um, they put them on my bike the next day. I took it out on a rough road. I aimed for every pothole I could find. And even though the setting was not perfect for me at that time, it was a really nice ride. It was a really nice ride. And I've since redone the setting, and now it's just like tuned in. I, I can ride five, six hours. I'm not feeling any, any extra pain or anything like Great. that. Great. I'm a little heavier. I'm around 300 pounds. I uh, have it on a half inch sag, and I set it down the dial on two. Great, and that seems to just work great. So you were able to tune it right in just by messing with the rebound knob, huh? Yeah, exactly. The rebound knob did everything I needed to do. I didn't have to adjust the springs at all. So after you made that investment, is that something you'd recommend to other riders? I already have. There's another guy just bought some this uh, yesterday here. So yeah, I, I talk about it all the time. Talk about it to my friends and, and show them to people just how easy they are to adjust. You'd mentioned to me earlier that you were debating between more stereo or buying shocks. Yeah. Are you happy you went with shocks? Yeah, I'm real happy I went with shocks. <laughs> yeah, I can right. still hear my music and I can, I can hear it longer on the bike because I can ride longer. Excellent.